Hi guys, I know it has been a while since I really, really came on here and made a video for you guys. So I decided to show you guys how I make my nose cuffs with crystals or gemstones. And it's just showing you my um, creative process and how I just come about uh, the shapes for my um, nose cuffs. So this particular one, I just kind of go with the flow and make the shape as I go. As you can see, I'm just bending the wire with my needle nose plier um, at different angles just to see how I like it. And it also depends on the gemstone or crystal that I'm using. Here I'm using a kind of weird shaped crystal. It is a pointed um crystal on one side so i'm kind of making like that kind of point in my bins so that it matches perfectly to the crystal and you will see once i fit it flush to the to the wire um why i'm bending it the way i'm bending it so i'm just playing around with the shapes here and um making sure that it's long enough for uh the typical no shape um and it, it really just takes some some playing around with the wire to see if you like it and uh, see how the design looks on a nose um, so you will see in just a second here how I actually um, fit it to the nose You're going to want to grab your nose mannequin um, and get it ready and you're gonna pound once I get the uh, shape to what I like it to and what and I'm not gonna make changes I, I just pound it out with the hammer um, so that the um, the the design is basically set then I try it on my nose mannequin as you can see it is perfectly flush with the nose it is the perfect height um, for the nose and then I go ahead and bend it and make the um, paper clip back that's what I like to call this type of um, clip um, because it looks like a paper clip and I adjust the size based on the nose you you have to kind of gauge um, you know how long of a clip you're gonna need because some people's noses are smaller some are bigger so for this particular customer I just went with a standard nose type based on the mannequin um, so as you can see I will try it on the mannequin so you can see how well it goes up the no up the nose or how well it fits um, and if you need to make changes you can cut off more wire or you can um, make sure you don't cut off too much wire just snip a little bit as you go so that you won't have to start all the way over here I'm just showing you how the nose cuff looks try it on the nose cuff see how it looks make any changes as you see fit here I'm just going to cut a little bit more of the wire off and um, file it down again because you don't want it to be pointy or sticking your, your client in the nose. So make sure that all of your pointy ends are filed down to be dull. And then try it on the nose mannequin again. Uh, make sure it fits. Make any necessary changes. take my uh, 22 gauge or a smaller wire to um, wrap the crystal around the larger wire and here you can see I'm just fitting it to the nose cuff trying to see where it will best fit. Now you want to wrap your smaller wire around the larger wire and I do it 
where it is neat and you can see the wire wrap and it makes the design um, and I pull them close to the um, to the crystal and as you can see I'm just perfecting it each and every time I go around making sure it's tightly wrapped but not too tight that it will break because this type of wire can snap easily if you try to pull it really really tight um, so just be careful of that and you can also break your your crystal by pulling it too tight so you just want to carefully wrap it and then carefully squeeze it tightly and make sure it's snugly fit when you're wrapping Here I'm taking my my flat nose plier and I'm just squeezing uh, the wire in and flattening flattening the wire to the larger wire, uh, making sure that there are no pieces sticking out, nothing that will irritate the client's nose or skin, uh, making sure that it's snugly fit and it won't go anywhere. Uh, once I do that, I just continue to wrap the other side the opposite way, uh, making sure that it is when you're going into a curve or a uh, bend in the larger wire, make sure to wrap it tightly and go along the wire. Because if not, it will show gaps in the in the wire and it won't look pleasant. Now you just want to take your flat nose plier and bend any sharp corners, making sure it's flat, making sure that everything looks correct in the way you want it. And here is my finished result. And this is the way um, that I like the cuffs to be. You may want something different. Try all types of shapes. Play around with the wire bending. Take some practice wire and do uh, a, a rough draft. But here is my finished result. And I hope you guys love this nose cuff. And also, check out the rest of my videos. Follow my page and my channel so you can see more designs. Love you guys. Bye.